But was you really surprised that she was using you for attention? I mean, like, during the calls and shit, we were over here talking about sex. We were talking about, oh, when I see you, I'm going to kiss you, this, that, and the third. And I thought and I thought to myself, like, oh, she's about it. Like, you know, we would get into that conversation. And okay. she came through and she was like, oh, no. Like, and I don't know if she wanted me to be a boyfriend or what, but I had to push back and tell her, like. Call her, call her, like, call, know, her, call, really call, her call her, call her, call her, call her, call her, call her, call her. Listen, you said when I see you, I'm, she, you said that she said when she see you, she going to kiss you, right? No, no, no. I told her that. You she told her like, that. Yeah, okay, cool, cool. You, you know, told her that. You told, yeah, her, that. told her that. You told her that. So you thought she was about that, right? I, I, th- I thought that she was going to pop off. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Mom. All right, all right. Cool, 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 cool. So that, that, that one date that y'all went on when she came after she came back to your city, what was the first thing you did when, when y'all met up for the date? I tried to give her a hug. She kind of kind of like pulled back, and I was like, what the fuck? That's what I realized. <laughs> <laughs> no, I gave her a, I gave her a hug. I gave her a hug, but it wasn't a good hug. I was trying to, you know, I was trying to like, you know, get that, like you say, Miles, not the church hug. And this bitch is over here giving me church hugs and shit. And that's when I was like, fuck, bro. <laughs> and why do you think she giving you church hugs? Because I, I, I ignored the rules of the game. Like that's what I'm saying. Like. Let me, let, me, let, me, let, me, let me tell you why. Let me, let me tell you why. Let me, hold on. Call her. Call her. Call her. Call her. I'm going to tell you why she gave you the church hug. It's real simple. And mostly I don't get this. The reason why she gave you the church hug and she giving you that type of energy is because she knows you're a liar. <laughs> because check this out. You, you said, oh, I'm just trying to build rapport and get to know her. You know what women know for sure? You understand? They know that niggas don't want to get to know them. (laughs) So when you say shit like this, she knows that you're a fraud. See, women know you're trying to fuck. You're pretending to try to get to know a woman. See, that's what women say. Women are like, well, I want to get to know you and I want you to get to know me. But that's what they're saying. But they know when they meet a nigga, when they meet a new dude, we don't give a shit about getting to know them. You see what I'm saying? We don't care. We're trying to fuck. Now, in the in, in, and this is the thing. A real nigga knows that he can't even know a bitch unless he fuck her. You see what I'm saying? So so how the fuck are we getting to know each other when 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 you're not trying to fuck? So any of that shit you talking, right? She knows that you're a liar. So what happens is she's like, oh, he's one of these niggas because he's talking to me on the phone all day. He's giving me all this attention. See, real niggas who got game don't do that. Why? Because real niggas who got game don't give a shit about none of that. They only give a shit about a woman following their directions. A nigga with game is busy. He got shit to do. He ain't got time to be talking on the phone with a woman for hours. You see what I'm saying? So you already showed her through your actions you're not that guy. Huh? Like, I didn't have the time to do it, but I did it anyway. Exactly. That's why I fucked up. Exactly. That's what I was saying, bro. <laughs> you fucking, you fucking push the side shit you have to do. You know? Wait, how, how, how long you talk to her on the phone? Bro, we would talk for like, each time we got on the phone, bro, it was like more than at least two hours. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God! I, know, I thought that shit was mine, bro, but I ignored y'all, and that's what happened to me, bro. <laughs> Dude, Yo, bro, one night, one night, I stayed up the whole night. I didn't get no sleep, and I had to work twelve hours. I stayed up for five hours on the phone with this bitch. Oh and, my God! Oh. This thing is wild, bro. <laughs> Do you, do you guys see what we talk about when we tell y'all niggas? If y'all ain't got game, this is going to be a life. I'm over here thinking I got game and shit when I'm over here keeping these bitches on the phone. Yo, Carla, let me ask you real quick. So that time that y'all, you spent on the phone f- for five hours, was this before or after the date? Back in this your city. This was before the date, bro. This was before the date. So listen, so you don't think... So if a woman really likes you and she lives in your city... Well, the, no. well, technically the second day, second day when she, you know, did the bullshit. No, 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 yeah. hold on. The first, no, no, no. The first day you talk, you you talking about the first day in in Mexico? Well, 
I mean, that's when I met her. So I consider that the first day. You said the first no, day, but I'm talking about no, 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 no. Me, when you met her in Mexico was not the not not a date. That was you just meeting her. Huh? Yeah, no, that was you oh, just shit. meeting her. But listen, listen to what I'm saying, and I want you to think logically with me. You and a woman live in the same city. Now, in yeah. if a woman could stay on the phone with you for five hours. If she really liked you, don't she think she would be like, yo, fuck this phone shit. If we're going to be on the phone for five hours, let's just meet up. Right. Like, where are you at right yeah. now? Can I come yeah. to your crib? Can you you want to come to my crib? Because, look, why, why, we, why, why are we on the phone for five hours? Let's just spend some real time together. Don't you think that makes more sense? Yeah. Now, before you go, click the link below and go to badboymembership.com. Now, badboymembership.com is a place where you go to get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Listen, I know you're tired of being rejected. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of being afraid to approach women. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of not getting the women that you want. Go to badboymembership.com. Listen, I know you're tired of being alone on a Friday night. Go to badboymembership.com. Now picture this. You'll go from not getting what you want when it comes to you dealing with women to actually getting what you want, to being the guy women want to be with, women want to date, women want to have sex with. All you need to do is go to badboymembership.com, follow the steps, learn the game, implement the game, and then you will get the woman you want. Make sure you go to badboymembership.com today. Click the link below. Click the link below or go straight to MrLocario.com to get the documentary Game Kings, The Definition of Game.